Australia's long-awaited federal battery rebate is here and it's one of the biggest energy incentives we've seen in over a decade. If you're thinking about adding a battery to your home or business, you could save thousands of dollars up front. I'm Jeff from Solar Choice, and in this video, I'll explain exactly how the rebate works, how much you can save, and what you need to know to qualify. The rebate is part of the Labor government's Cheaper Home Battery Program, which officially started on the 1st of July, 2025. It's a federal scheme designed to reduce the cost of a typical battery by 30% or $372 per usable kilowatt hour of storage. In practical terms, it's more like $350 per usable kilowatt hour once you factor in the admin costs of actually claiming the rebate. For a typical 13 kilowatt hour battery, that's a saving of around $4,000. This rebate is delivered through the same federal scheme that powered Australia's rooftop solar boom, the Small Scale Renewable Energy Scheme. The best part, it's not means tested. If you own a property and have or are installing solar, you'll likely be eligible. That includes homeowners, strata buildings, businesses, even community groups like sports clubs and libraries. You can claim the rebate on any new battery system between five and 100 kilowatt hours, though, the rebate only applies to the first 50 kilowatt hours of usable storage. It must be installed by an accredited installer and use Clean Energy Council approved battery and inverter products. And yes, if you've got a battery, you can add another battery and still qualify. Here's what the numbers look like in real terms. A 10 kilowatt hour battery, according to the Solar Choice price index, might cost you around $11,000 100 with, without the rebate. Under this program, you could save around $3,440, bringing the net cost to just over $7,600. Bigger batteries get a bigger discount. A 20 kilowatt hour system could qualify for over $6,800 in savings. Just remember, the rebate will decline each year through to 2030. If you're planning to install sooner is better. So what about the ongoing savings? A 10 kilowatt hour battery can cut your energy bills by $700 to $1,500 a year, depending on how you use power and where you live. That typically is gonna mean a payback period as little as five to seven years, with free storage for years to follow. You can add in the potential of virtual power plants. These provide rewards, and the battery is also gonna provide protection from blackouts and greater energy independence. The benefits go beyond the dollars. So can we stack this with state rebates. Yes, in New South Wales and WA, there are state-based incentives that you can combine the federal battery rebate with to create an even more attractive scenario. In Western Australia, with the Western Australian Home Battery Scheme, you can get interest-free loans of up to $10,000. In New South Wales, you'll be able to stack the federal battery rebate with the New South Wales government's VPP incentive, which can offer an extra $500 to $1,500 depending on the battery's capacity. The federal battery rebate is already driving a surge in battery demand, and it's not hard to see why. With solar feed-in tariffs falling, the power prices on the rise, storing your own solar power is becoming even more attractive than it's ever been. Just like when sol the solar rebates launched, we expect a short-term supply shortages and installation delays as demand surges. So if you're thinking about getting a battery, now's the time to start planning. Want to see how these batteries compare for your home? Use our free battery calculator to estimate costs and savings and compare quotes from vetted local installers near you. I'm Jeff from Solar Choice. Thanks for watching. Hit like, subscribe, and check out the links below for tools and guides to help electrify your home.